Turn right. Hey guys, so it is come on, has come. My water broke and I'm headed to the hospital. Yes, yeah, so it's Tuesday, August 3rd. I feel like I and I'm here with my sister guys. David has COVID and he can't going? come. Like, oh my god. I never thought this would happen. But he don't have any results back yet, but they think he might have COVID. Hopefully he don't. And when he get back the lab results, it'll be negative. Okay, that he I want to back, okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so my sister taking me to the hospital now. Um, my water didn't gush out. It's just like a little, it had a little squish, like squish, and it ran on my leg. But in like when Delina was coming, like a gush. So, yeah, that's what's going on. Like, I kind of sad David didn't be there, but yeah. Chissy Poo is here. <laughs> so, baby. I'll keep you guys once you reach there. I'll let you know what's up. I'm all hooked up. Baby boy is moving a ton. I have a little thing on my finger. They haven't checked me as yet. Yeah. They haven't checked me as yet, so I'm just waiting to see. I'm waiting to see the doctor. Alright, I go for my phone to charge. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so we just waiting to see the doctor. It'll plug into the wall. It ain't a charger like for oh, the car. So that's my phone charger. Hey, put on my phone in for now. My sister is here with me waiting on the doctor to check me to see if my um, sample to see if it's my water break and if I dilated or anything. So that's what's going on right now. So we're just waiting to see the doctor. My battery's dying, so I can put the charge right now. Hey, you guys. So I'm still here downstairs in triage. It's about what time do? It? It's 4:52 now, and I just got checked. I'm actually five, five ninety centimeters dilated, so we're progressing. So I'll be staying. Um, I'm having contractions, like I have one right now. I don't know if you can see. Can you see it? You can see the rise. I have one like right now. If we start to rise, like some of them high and some of them low. Yeah, but they're not too painful. I still talking to them, of course. But we're moving. 
So I just here waiting for um, a bed to open up upstairs and it should be heading up. And then we might have a baby today or early in the morning. You gonna be up? <laughs> I asked him, I said she gonna be up. So yeah. So he might be today, August 3rd or August 4th. So we wait and see. Keep you guys. Feeling a little tired, she went to get me some popsicles to eat. Say hi. What's up? Yeah, David wish he was here, but he can't be. Yeah, so still having contractions. Just switching over now to the new crew for the night. So we're gonna wait and see what they say, the care plan they're gonna put me on. If they're gonna use Potosin. I had Potosin last year, so probably might do that to speed up contractions. Um, round two, I was like, when I came in, I was three. Before we came up here, I was 590. So I probably like way far out of hand. Yeah, because I've been having a lot of contractions, but they're not painful. Like to the point where I can't breathe. I still could I could talk through some of them, but yeah, so far so good. So hopefully he come tonight. We have a baby tonight. Um, I can't wait to eat some food. Though. <laughs> I can't wait to eat. Come eat nothing for the day. And he had breakfast and it's like. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Huh? I saw a lot of Found another popsicle. Right? Yeah, I got I get some ice chips. When she come back and ask for some ice chips this morning. Um, yeah, eat a popsicle already. Plus she gave me some fluids in the IV, so. But I ain't feeling hungry, but I feel like I want to eat something. Mm -hmm. But you know how it is. So it's 7.30 now. So I'm gonna check back in with you guys a little later because nothing is happening right now. We're just sailing along.
saw my tita purple from the uh, thing, my ultrasound down. And um, I did a COVID test as well because David got back his results and it was positive. So they gave me a test to make sure I don't have it. So I'm just waiting on the doctor now. He gonna look at the ultrasound and um, see what we're gonna do. They're gonna stop me in Pitocin or to speed up the contractions. It's about 10, 33 it looks like. like it's 10, like 10.33 in the night. And I just hear having contractions. They're a little harder, but nothing like overbearing. So, just here waiting. The waiting game now. So, I'll check back in with you guys. Hey guys, so we're about there, 10 centimeters. Mama's doing good. She's doing great, big contractions. We have daddy on the phone. So soon we will have a baby. This is my first time vlogging. I'm her sister, by the way. Um, but she's doing good for the most part. Everything's looking good, baby sounds good. And he will be out in no time and we will be back with you guys.
how long is your breast fed? I don't know how long you're welcome. Yeah. What are you gonna do now? Oh, sorry. Okay, good. I'm gonna do you guys. I finally get to eat. <laughs> she had some soup. She has some carrots, some mac and cheese, and chicken breast. Some pears, jello, and apple juice. And she ate her crackers also. You're about to head upstairs in a few. Baby's over there. He's doing good. So she's just really hungry. <laughs> hey, feminine. Hi. He was swaddled, but he wiggled his way out. <laughs> I think he's hungry.